here in Rosemont, Illinois. A very special guest joining us for our first chair chat of the year. The Oregon head coach, Missy Lombardi, just finished up year six in Eugene. Coach, thanks so much for joining us. What are you doing in Rosemont? <laughs> just watching a little softball. I love AU. I've been watching it since the first year. So I got an opportunity to come out here and I'm pumped to be here on opening night. Well, what do you think of uh, the captain over there at shortstop? How's she doing? I think she's doing great. I love that left side, so I think she's doing great. Sydney Romero at shortstop, the captain, assistant coach at Oregon for Missy Lombardi. Coach, did she ask you any tips here running the own team, or is she doing this all on her own? No, she's got it going on. She, she was talking to me a little bit about having to draft, and she was doing her research and, you know, excited to see, like, who she was going to get on her team. So I thought she did really good. Coach, tell us what Sydney does for you at Oregon. Sid is great. Um, I had the opportunity to coach her at Oklahoma, and then just when we had an opportunity to get her, um, I was pumped to get her at Oregon. But she she works with our defense. Uh, she also works with our hitters, um, and assists Coach Martyr and um, Coach uh, Alyssa Palomino Cardoza. And um, you know what? She's just what's awesome is that she's still playing, and our athletes love that. They get to see her train, and I think she's just very very relatable to our athletes. Um, you know if they have a field question I mean she's she's playing and um, I think she's just able just to have like a really good relationship uh, with her still playing pro ball and, and you know just she's been there she's done that she's played on the grandest stage she's won a couple natties so yeah. we're just we love having her I think it's so cool that you allow her you know the space to continue her playing career is that something that she talked to you going into when you hired her like hey this is something that I would like to continue to do is there space for me to do that yes that we definitely spoke about that and I said absolutely you know I we should be able to play the sport as long as we want just like everybody else so I, I'm all for it and I just think with her playing pro and, and playing here with AU, uh, what it does for her and for her to live out her dream, but also what it does for our athletes as well. Coach, after having her as a player and now seeing her in this different role as a coach, what's the contrast? Is there anything that surprised you about her demeanor in this new role? No, I I, I feel like Sid, Sid's always just very calm, cool, uh, just a competitor. Um, you know, she loves to win and so, how I saw her as a player, I, I see it, you know, on the coaching side too. And then coach, just talk to us about what you like watching, you know, about AU as a fan, you know, of course, you know, Sydney and Gwen is an alum of yes. Oregon. So like, what is it about AU that draws you in? Um, I just, it, I think just the athletes are unbelievable. And um, I just love like their passion. Um, they're just their desire to be great. Uh, just, the constant having to change things up because you know they're constantly seeing each other over and over. I think that's really cool. Um, I don't know. I just think you just get to come here and see the best of the best, and um, it's it's awesome. I love what Sherry's doing. I love what Gwen's doing. Huge fan of of what Gwen's doing on and off the field here. Um, just to see some of our you know other former Ducks playing. You know, these guys are getting to live their dream out and, and continue to play softball as long as they want. And I think that's really, really important. Well, we have two outs here, so you might have to keep your answers short here. But for any Oregon fans listening in, give us a little synopsis about what to expect for 2025. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited about 2025. Uh, 20, We've got a great young team. Um, I think you're going to see us run a ton. I think you're going to see some good power. I think we're going to really love our pitching staff. And I, I think our defense is always just really, really excellent. So... I'm enjoying the break, but I'm excited for our team to get back and, and get after it in the fall. Coach, thanks for the time. Best of luck in the Big Ten next year. Yes, we're looking forward to it. I actually, when I, I was coming here, I went right past the office. So hey, was, you are in Big Ten country right now. Yes, yeah, we are. Absolutely. So we're looking forward to it. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate the time. All right. Thank you.